Hi everyone, welcome or welcome back to my channel. In today's video, we're going to go ahead and pick some cards to see what's going on in this connection. How's your person feeling about you? What would they say to you? Where is this headed? And any other messages we can get from the cards here. I want to start off your reading by picking cards from the Numinous deck to see what the general energy, vibes, essence are, okay? Um, or is, yeah. Uh, before getting started with the reading, I do want to just um, use my sound bowl that I got to clear out any energy um, to help, you know, charge the cards so we can get the most accurate messages and, you know, just do some like sound frequency healing so i'm just gonna go ahead and do that just ring this a couple of times okay okay yeah i think i'm gonna like make some more videos about like you know sound healing because i do feel like you know music sound all that plays such a big role in our life uh right so it's important that we do at least a little bit of research about you know how it impacts us so um maybe i'll come out with a video you know keep an eye out for that but in the meantime i'm gonna go ahead and shuffle the cards to see what's going on in this connection um you know how's your person feeling what would they want to convey to you uh especially if you're in separation in the 3d we got scorpio the animal okay i'm getting some scorpio placements this is a really deep intense connection that has transformed the course of both of your lives okay this person i feel like they didn't uh maybe they're like processing it now okay or maybe they didn't fully process the depth of this connection but like they are just like realizing like how much this has changed their life i feel like you know when this person came into your life this helped you level up in a lot of different ways maybe you were you were already spiritual when you met this person but i feel like this person helped you up level to the next leg of your spiritual journey okay i feel like this person um you know like i'm seeing like regeneration rebirth renewal like the both of you are transforming into the best highest versions of yourself i uh also remember hearing or like you know seeing some videos about how the earth is shifting from the 3d to the 5d so it's not like anything's like necessarily physically changing but i just feel like you know energetically vibrationally um like you know you're stepping into a newer higher dimension because of all the work that you've been doing on yourself okay and i do feel like you know um there's a lot of like good positive energy coming in for you i do feel like if you've been feeling kind of off or uh, maybe your energies maybe things have just felt kind of like dark or just like you know maybe you've just been like not feeling that light-hearted uh i do feel like things are going to be changing i feel like um you know you're going to be feeling a lot better a lot more happier a lot more emotionally fulfilled okay uh i do feel like you had to go through this sort of like you know process like this uh process of renewal regeneration i'm seeing like cellular regeneration you're becoming a completely new version of yourself i do feel like this connection has made you you know get deeper into manifestation self-concept work and you know you're becoming a whole new person you're shedding layers of yourself okay um you're thinking of the past differently you're rewriting your past okay i'm also seeing the same thing is going on with this person i do feel like this person is changing for the better uh they're going to be a lot more communicative more loyal maybe if you experienced a version of this person that was kind of like you know a player or like maybe someone that you couldn't trust this person is going to come back and be the most loyal committed version of themselves for you and like you know you're the game changer you're the life like like this has been a very life-changing thing for them you have changed up um so much in their life for the better and like now they've met you now that they've you know gotten a taste of you they just can't let you go okay um oh my gosh this reminds this reminds me of that song uh lightning in a bottle baby she's like lightning in a bottle now that i got you so, oh my gosh i'm so bad at uh, remembering lyrics someone look up that song and listen to that song i feel like i really like the energy of that um yeah the song but lightning in a bottle okay there's a lot of sparks uh you know there's a lot of passion passionate energy in this connection the both of you still feel that passion for each other you know the spark is still there they still carry a flame for you okay um baby she's like or you're like lightning in a bottle now that i got you i can't let go if i want it or so something like that oh, oh i need to get better at remembering lyrics but anyways let's go and pick some more cards we got the fifth house of passion what the heck did i just say oh my gosh passion that's amazing also i just got a notification during this feeding but wow um yeah they are really passionate about you i do feel like you know this person is really attracted to you. they like going on dates with you they like spending time with you okay um and it's like this connection has both it's like you know they feel that attraction towards you but there is also the sense of like you know there, there is a deeper connection here there is this deep emotional connection here as well okay they want to romance you um you know they, they want to like they, they want to spoil you i'm seeing like you know dinners like you know just more fun dates maybe dates at the fair okay i'm definitely seeing some light-hearted energy is you know coming into your life again especially if you've been feeling heavy intense you know you're you're going to be uh there's some sort of like weight that's being lifted off your shoulder i do feel like you're also releasing some emotional 
emotional baggage maybe forgiving um you know past versions of yourself letting go of certain things okay uh that's all really exciting here i'm gonna go ahead and pick some cards from the dark mansion tarot deck to see what other messages we have here from your person yeah we got the hermit yeah i do feel like the both of you could be in hermit mode right now or like you know maybe there's some sort of like separation that's going on here but this hermit is good because this is someone who seeks wisdom and guidance and maybe you know goes into solitude to do that or spend some time to themselves to do that okay so i feel like if you're not connected right now in the 3d um the both of you are just taking some time to like you know really heal heal something within yourself okay um i do feel like you know this connection could have been casual maybe this uh was never really labeled or anything like that but i do feel like it is headed towards something deeper and serious but i do feel like you know there there is something that they need to like release let go of um before they can come in and give you that full commitment okay um yeah we also got here the empress i'm seeing here with this empress okay i'm getting some virgo energy leo scorpio taurus uh libra energy sun moon rising venus you know they see you as like uh like that person the one like the one that they want to spend their life with okay the empress uh like this is like the mother of children vibe father of children vibe the husband the wife like the spouse the partner the lifelong partner okay that is what this person wants that is what this person wants with you specifically okay i am seeing with this empress card here um you know you're really stepping into your divine feminine energy your divine masculine energy you're becoming you know wiser you're becoming less reactive you know i'm seeing like healing your nervous system like you've really been working on yourself okay self-love okay and because of that you're glowing you're magnetic a lot of people are really attracted to your energy a lot of people think about you a lot uh maybe you could have people from the past reach out to you okay this also has to do with fertility growth abundance so i really do feel like you know the both of you are nurturing this connection this person really wants to nurture this connection the both of you are nurturing this connection energetically by you know know thinking about the other okay yeah um we also got here the two of swords yeah so i do feel like there was some like you know indecisive type energy or like you know some sort of like back and forth with this person or hot and cold behavior and you know that kind of irked you a little bit because you're just like you felt like you were really sure about this person you wish this person was as sure about you as you know you are about them uh but let's go and pick some more clarifying cards to see what's going on there okay so we got the ace of swords i feel like this person is going to finally make up their mind and you know be more communicative i feel like this is the type of person that when they want something or someone they will go after it and nothing can stop them like at that point like it's like you know they're gonna do anything it takes to be with you and they're locked in for life okay but it does take them some time to like actually like you know um like be firm with that or it does take them a little bit of like you know thinking um or like you know reflecting or like you know just, just some time to uh make sure that this is what they really want right like uh but like it's that, that's actually a good way about going about things because sometimes people will just like you know indulge into something impulsively and it'll just like blow up in their face right but this person likes taking their time but it's like once they're in it they're in it for good okay we also got here the king of wands i'm seeing here with this king of wands they are really passionate about you um and you know they want to pursue you more i really like this the king of wands empress like again i just feel like the both of you are up leveling to that next uh highest version of yourself right because like we're always growing improving learning evolving right and like that is something that i do see this person doing i do feel like you know they're stepping into uh you know the, the higher version of themselves i feel like you know uh, this king of wands is someone who knows how to be in a relationship someone who pursues uh people wholeheartedly you know someone who is like firm in their decision i feel like you know this person um you know needed to be uh, you know feel a little bit more confident in themselves i feel like you're also working on you know being and feeling more confident confident and safe and secure within yourself and you know that's really reflecting that's i'm seeing like the both of you um you know are meant to be together i feel like the both of you uh you know like this person maybe was a little bit slow slower to realize like you know just how deep and significant this connection is but you knew all along but it's like now this person's going to be like you know um pursuing you a lot they're going to be doing all the like you know graduate work. if you feel like you've been the one always reaching out to this person and maybe doing the energetic work like this person is gonna um you know g give you back that energy like they're going to be matching your energy okay and this person is going to show you that they are really into that they really do want this connection to go somewhere and that they really do care about you a lot okay um i'm going to go ahead and pick some card uh cards from the soulmate love messages deck to see what other messages we have here yeah we got when i'm sad i look at your pictures and feel much better you guys like i feel like your beauty is really healing to them they think you're so attractive and they feel really good like you know being around you being around your energy being around your vibes your presence okay um wow so this is how real love feels like okay i feel like it's like hitting them now like any day now they're just going to wake up and realize that they've been in 
love with you all along okay like you know how people change their minds all the time you know they could wake up and be like you know i don't want to do this or they could wake up and like you know start feeling a certain way about people or certain things right like i feel like this person especially if you've been manifesting for them to like you know come back love you be in a healthy committed relationship with them okay like they're just gonna wake up one day and be like okay wait i'm in love with this person aka you and the, you know that's gonna uh, they're gonna finally act on those feelings okay i feel like the momentum is like building up okay or the energy is gaining momentum this person is definitely going to be coming back to you and like there's nothing even you can do to stop it okay i just feel like at this point like you know you and your person you're locked in okay so yeah um anyways i will go ahead and end the reading right here i really hope this helps uh take what resonates and leave what doesn't you always have for you in your reality i do want to let you know that i offer in-depth tarot readings as well as manifestation coaching and also custom make subliminal so if you are interested in any of these services check out the description box below where you, you will find my website you can sign up for those services through my website and yeah i will see you all next time thank you so much love and light